we're gonna be talking about being aggressive one shot too early. And as you see, I've hit my shot over here into a little bit of a sticky situation. But I know what you're thinking. There's a gap up there. I can squeeze it through those trees, keep it left, run it up on the side of the green, maybe have it roll down to the right, narrowly missing that bunker, by the way, and have a putt at birdie. Or I could pitch it back out here into the fairway and then be aggressive with my wedge shot onto the green and have a nice putt at par. Which one do you think I wanna choose? I really wanna choose the one to go through the gap, but I'm gonna pitch it back out into the fairway and as you are gonna see, I'm gonna be aggressive with my wedge shot and give myself that chance at making par after a bad drive like this. So now this is the time to be aggressive. I have a wedge in my hand, I have an open look at the flag stick sitting right there in front of me. I'm gonna take dead aim and I'm gonna hit the shot that I really commit to. So my challenge to you is the next time that you guys get on the golf course and you find yourself in a situation where you might be too aggressive or you might think the risk is not worth the reward, are you doing it one shot too early? Take the easy shot, take the safe route, and then be aggressive when you have an open opportunity. Now guys, it's not only when you are in trouble that you need to think about, am I being too aggressive one shot too early? Is it the time that you have a six iron in your hand and you see the pin on the very far right of the green tucked behind a bunker? Could you play it a little bit longer, a little farther left maybe, and then be aggressive on that 30 foot putt? So my challenge again is to go out there and the next time you're playing, just think to yourself, Am I being a little bit too aggressive right now when I could just wait one shot and be aggressive on that next one?